Okay, so welcome back. So let's talk about even and odd functions when it comes to trigonometric functions. So again, the same idea applies. So let's look at this unit circle here. And so if I look at um, this first quadrant angle, let's look at sine. Okay, if I look at sine, uh, sine of theta is what? So, as we know, sine of theta equals y, right? Um, but if we look at this, sine of negative theta equals negative y, which equals what? Negative sine theta. So, in this regard, we show that sine is an odd function. Or no. Hold on a second. Oh, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Okay, right. <clears throat> but, notice that we also showed that it's not even, because we just showed that sine of negative theta is not the same as sine theta. Okay, so it's not even, but we showed that it's odd. Okay, and so what if we use... Um, some of the other trick functions. And we say, okay, well, do we have any other trick functions that if we put in theta and we put in the opposite of theta, that we're going to get either the same function out or, or a different function? Okay. And so we can test it using the same similar stuff, right? Do I get the same function or not? So I, we can use the fact that if I start looking at um, x, right? So we'll put x here, and this is 1. Oops. And 1. And so we can start testing to see which functions are even and which functions are odd. For example, what if I use look at um, <coughs> tangent? Well, if I look at tangent, tangent is what? Tangent of theta is y over x. Okay, now what if I put in the opposite angle? Tangent of negative theta. Well, what does that mean? Well, that's going to be what? Negative y over x, right? Which gives me what? Negative of tangent theta, right? Because then I get negative of tangent theta. Tangent theta is equal to y over x, right? So again, so now I just showed that tangent is an odd function. And so we can do the same thing with all of the other four trigonometric functions, and then we could know which ones are odd and which ones are even. Have a great day.